this. So today I made some collard greens, fried chicken, some rice, and some homemade cornbread. It's about to be a bust down and I'm about to show you how to make it. <laughs> okay, so you just gotta stack them on top of each other. And after you stack them up, you gotta roll it together. And I'm gonna show you that next. Okay, not even. So you see how I rolled it up? Just like that. Uh -oh. And then you cut it down the middle on one side first. And then you go cut the front. Uh-oh. And then you're gonna do the whole thing like that. So you're just gonna rinse them off again with some hot water. Do it like that. And you're just gonna pull it off. Make sure you get all the grain off of it because you don't want no gritty greens. Go. So what I did was first before I cut up and wash the greens, I just put some um, smoked turkey in there and let that boil so the flavor can come. And now I'm gonna add some chicken broth to the water. Chicken broth, chicken broth. <laughs> and then I'm gonna add the greens and season it later. <clears throat> So it's been about 25 minutes and we add some more chicken broth. Just like that. And then I'm gonna season it with some more onion powder and garlic powder and just a teeny bit of sugar and season salt. See how these greens coming. I break that up a little bit. If I can, golly. Gotta start from the end and go on up. What if we get burnt meat on like this thing about it? I ain't no one touching nothing. Way okay. over here. Get it down to that bone. We're gonna start with some one can of cream corn. Well, I added a half a cup of sugar, but they forgot to get that part. And so now. You gotta put that in there? Yeah. Or I say that down. Some cornstarch. She wanted to talk about <laughs> Okay. Let's talk about her daddy, the uncle. <laughs> okay, a tablespoon of salt. And a half a cup of milk. This it. I know, I know. You never see nobody make no cornbread like this, but I tried it and it turned out the fuck great. Oh no! And then some softer butter. Okay. I 
bought a cup of honey that's the honeycomb in it. Don't have a mixer. <laughs> we just gonna have to stir it like so. Okay, so we're about to put our cornbread in the oven. I greased the skillet with this little cast iron pot. And that is, what is this? Cooking olive oil. We're gonna put a little stir. Okay. We're gonna pour it in. Okay, let me do it from this side. Okay. Yeah, so y'all can see. Until you realize. <laughs> okay. And we're just gonna you don't scrape the rest of that in there? So, okay. <laughs> I was trying to be fast. Oh, I got you. Since we're about to get not that, because okay, at this point, I'm just trying to hurry up and make this video. Yeah, Who he fussing at <laughs> and talking to like that? He better come correct. Just, now I'm just unthawing the chicken. I added some vinegar so I could clean it. And I'm just letting it be. Okay, so now we're about to start with the fried chicken. For a good coat, use mustard. I already preheated my oil. And then I'm using onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, and a buttery blend with a little bit of season salt. Must have been wet. <laughs> okay, so what I have right here is um, some flour and I have the same seasonings in here and then I'm just going to stir it up with my hands until it's all mixed in together because you do not want no plain tasted chicken even though you season the chicken but still you gotta season the flour okay now that we got that like that we're gonna add the chicken in here And then we're going to put the top up. And we're going to shake it. And it should look like that. Shake off the excess. Lay it to the side. Why the goose getting hurt? Okay. All right, so now we got to add our chicken to our goose. So the big pieces first. Two at a time, baby. Two at a time. No, because why did I record this food so close? Y'all can't even see the finished final result. That motherfucker was good, though.